everyone, and welcome back to the Preparation Station. I hope everybody's having a great week. Not too bad so far th this week. We'll see how it goes. Okay, so here I go again. Dollar Tree. They love me there. I spend way too much money there. Uh, okay, but today I wanted to kind of focus on pets. Well, um, I have cats. Two of them. I think you... If you've been watching my videos, you've seen both of them. Uh, I don't have any dogs at this time, so I didn't really get into the dog part, but um, I am covering stuff for the cats. So, uh, Dollar Tree, Dollar General, and a little bit of Walmart. So, okay, first things first. I wanted to go, I wanted to let you know, um, Dollar Tree actually has nine lives. Now they have this one and this one. And these are both 12 ounces. A dollar. I mean, this could, for my cats, I mean, it's three days, four days. Okay, they also have some yeah because my hands in the way so you can see that <laughs> you know one of those things it's like I said they've got this one meaty uh super supper they've got this one with real chicken and tuna and something fell and this one with real beef. Now, that's pretty good for a dollar. Uh, when I went to Dollar General, um, they had the Nine Lives on sale for a dollar. Uh, they did have Sheba for 80 cents, and they had Imes for 90 cents. No, I'm sorry. Imes was a dollar. Um, now, if I'm going to buy the little... Uh, little ones, I will go with something like Sheba or Imes that are in the little containers because they're easy to break apart. And what I do is um, I'll use those as treats. You know, I'll open them, break them up. Each one gets one half for a treat because my vet told me to make sure that the cats get dry food because if they are and just and the canned food, wet food, uh, occasionally, because if they are fed the uh, canned food all the time, it can mess with their gums. And I would rather have the cats with healthy teeth and gums, so I stick with the dry food. That was my vet. Maybe yours is different. Never know. Okay, so um, they also had different treats. Pounce. A little, I cannot read that. It's a little, tell you what, here we go. Okay. Um, they had small bags of Temptations and my cats love the Temptations. And then they had a little bit bigger one of the Nine Lives. And because my cats do love their Temptations, I usually buy this, the 16 ounce. And it is eight twenty four at Walmart and eight fifty at Dollar General. So we want to get this at Walmart. Um, so you know we like to guard our our furry children, just like we like to protect our children, human children. Um, they have, they didn't have collars, but these are the little liquid tabs that you put on their back. I mean, it does give you instructions on the back, but so I picked up two of them. They were a dollar a piece and there's only one in there where like some places you can get them. There's three, three of them in there, but I mean, not bad for a buck because they're, they'd be more expensive at Walmart. Um, I did pick up at Dollar General some cat collars. 
and these were six dollars at Dollar General. Um, is this spice scent? Who? What? What animal is picky about what their color smells like? Oh, uh, I don't know. But this is for cats and kittens, six months and over. So, kills fleas and ticks. And I did go to Walmart, and when I was there, I picked up a couple collars. These were $7.43. Um, they did have different ones that were $4.93, um, but I already put those on my cat. So, with the help of my niece's boyfriend. See, he's so awesome. Uh, but yeah, so different places have different things. It depends on what you like. I prefer the collars because uh, I know I have put liquid on uh, cats before and they are doing whatever they can to scratch at it and it's just, it's, it's an irritant to them. So the collar is not as bad. So I try to stick with the collars. Um, food wise, uh, okay, so when I was at Dollar Dollar General, I looked at their cat chow because I buy a cat chow cat complete. Um, their 12 ounce bag was $12. So I'm like, okay, eh. I went to Walmart. Their 20 ounce or 20 ounce, oh, 20 pound bag is $18.78. So I'm getting a better deal going to Walmart, getting the 20 pound bag. And if I said 12 ounce bag, I'm sorry, it was 12 pound bag at Dollar General. See, my notes. If I re actually read them, that might help instead of because, you know, sometimes, um, well, I have brown hair, but my mom does have blonde hair. So I'm just kind of going with that you know, blonde moment. Okay. So. I did find these. I thought these were pretty cool. They actually, they are non-skid. These were a Dollar Tree. Pretty cool. Love it. Uh, I also, they did have a single, so you can have food on one side, water on the other. They actually have a picture of a dog, but I'm sure cats could use it too. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with all these bowls. I will probably, uh, I will probably give this one away. Maybe these two. I'm not sure. Um, they did have... I thought this was really cool. And this was a Dollar Tree. This little ball they can play with. My cats are going to love it when they're actually able to play with it. So I was, I was kind of impressed with this. So I bought this one. Some of their other toys I wasn't really impressed with. Um, I don't know what's going on, but it's like... Every place is out of the really good cat toys. So if you can find really good cat toys, I would suggest picking them up if you have cats. Because when I was at Dollar General, I wasn't real thrilled about what they had then. And Dollar uh, Walmart, same way. And I have found some good uh, toys at Dollar Tree, Dollar General, and Walmart. But just for some reason, that was the only good one that I really found. Um, so these are actually for dogs, so I will find somebody that has a dog and give them away, uh, cause I do not, but, uh, there, this is waste bags. This one actually has a little clip and a little holder. You can clip onto your belt loop, carry this with you, and it's got some bags in there, and then they had... Uh, four pack of bags and um, I did find them at Dollar General they were uh, uh, they did have more in their package and I did not look to see what the price was but these are pretty pretty sturdy so I would I would go with the dollar Dollar Tree brand I don't have a problem with that but then again I'm not picking it up then but these are awesome because you're not, you can put your hand in the bag and then go over, right? So you're not touching anything. 
And that's that's the main thing, right? To me, it would be. Okay, so um, a couple things I wanted to share with you from Dollar Tree. Um, if we're in an SHTF situation, you're going to want to conserve water and you are not going to want to do dishes. You're not going to want to use your water for dishes. You're going to want to use it to either flush your toilet or clean it so that you can drink it or clean it so that you can make food with it. So uh, I would suggest having some plasticware in your preps. Um, Dollar Tree has a good variety of plasticware. This is a 48 piece set and they do ha they have different colors. I, I'm getting, you know, got blue because you know, it's me. But, um, and these are actually pretty, pretty sturdy. So I will definitely be putting those in my preps. They also had just a 48 pack of spoons. Forty-eight pack of just forks. I did not find any knives, but I did grab a pack with all three that were clear. So you, you could see they they don't have just colored, but they do have clear. And on the lines of not wanting to, you know, waste your water for doing dishes, I did pick up some plates. And actually, these plates are not bad. You can, 20 of them for a buck. And these are pretty decent. I mean, they're not like super flimsy or anything. I mean, they're, they're not Dixie, if you will, but they're, they're pretty nice. So I hope you all enjoyed this. Uh, one of my Dollar Tree, uh, excursions. I, like I said, I don't have a dog, so I really didn't do a whole lot with the dogs, but they do have, Dollar Tree has a stank ton of uh, dog treats and stuff like that. So if you do have a dog, check out Dollar Tree for treats and whatnot. I would, because I I couldn't believe the variety. And it's like, wait a minute, why aren't this, there this much for cats? I mean, they had a small section for cats and this huge section for dogs. Dollar Tree also had dog collars. Uh, they did not have any cat collars, at least at this time. I have seen them there before, but they did not have any when I was there. So I will check back for cat collars. With that, I will let you all go. You guys have a wonderful week. And... Please like, comment, and share. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell for all notifications. And please, if you have something that you would like me to price check or uh, do a show on, please let me know. We can certainly do that. I would, I would love to hear your feedback on all this stuff. So, please, 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 please. I, I love, re I, honest to God, I love reading all your comments. They are awesome. Uh, there's a, so many comments and it's like, and I try, I do try to mention everybody. Um, sometimes I don't mention the name because I'm not sure if people will like that. Um, so if you don't want your name mentioned, please let me know. Otherwise, um, I will shout people out because I want people to be acknowledged. I want, I want people to know that I am reading your comments because that is important to me. So just to let you know. All right. You guys have a great week. Please like, subscribe, share, comment, you know, all that good stuff great thumbs up. All right. Have a great week, everybody. Bye-bye for now.